We've been um, here today uh, with Womb 2, so we're a, um, a project um, initiative for women in music business. But before we start with our interview, she's actually going to do a short performance for us. Yeah, let's do another big round of applause for Mim, please. So the story is easily told when you're in your native heritage. Like you said, what, what was once as a person of my art has become now an artist within 50 years. It's given me a depth of life I've never had before. Hmm. Can you explain what you talk about? Okay, so I used to be a metallurgist. I didn't come from the background of musical art. So once I have gone into the art, it's taught me the value of my culture, the languages, and what art is, and its endless possibilities. So that's the depth that I'm talking about. It's endless. I would like to do a bit of opera singing. I really would like to. High energy mm. to the stage, and I'm talking high energy. Mm. I'm not telling you <laughs> <laughs> because it's just there. It's actually, quite a high energy person, or does that come out when you're in your musical kind of head? Daughter, what do you think? <laughs> do you think Mama is high energy person? I'm lazy. I'm lazy. <laughs> <laughs> When she's in her musical kind of element, the energy comes out. Would you say that's true, Vin? Do you say that you, personally, feel you really, really pushed yourself? Mm. And I'm talking really pushed yourself, you know? I always push myself. 100% full on at all times. At all times. There's no trial. There's no... Next time if I do this, whatever you do, give it all. Who is overcoming the virus? Aren't we all? I mean, not even even if it's not other people, I think, to be quite honest, other people are not that bad. I think the barriers within yourself are the worst ones. They are the ones that you should be questioning. I actually love traveling, and I love meeting new people, so. And I also feel certain amount, I mean, I do miss my children, uh, but they're getting bigger now. She's my youngest, so. Now, since she can talk the truth, she can start looking after herself from tomorrow. <laughs> so that's been easier for me because my children are getting... Do you actually write songs while you're working as a metallurgist or were you working as a metallurgist wanting to write songs? The first time this thing really came out alive for me, I went to my first festival at Walmart. 1999 or 2000 and I, I've never been to a festival so I was just crying and then one day a friend of mine says me you know do you want to come and do like drum and bass improv I went up there and I just smashed it I was like yeah I can do it <laughs> two months later I was like ta-da I'm off well you know people thought that was bonkers yeah so I left them there Thank you. <laughs> Thank you so much for joining us. Thank you for having me. So we're going to give you a cool again. You're going to be like a woman. Brilliant. Brilliant. Thank you, guys. Thank, Thank you. you. Thank you.
Come on, come on. 